on camera robbing gravestones at Oak Grove Cemetery. We start there. I'm Jim Dunaway. I'm Sherry Jackson. When you are the family of the deceased, this just hurts. CBS 42 News reporter Alex Mendy found out just how much when she talked to the family in this case. Alex is live at that cemetery off Highway 119 in Shelby County. And Alex, this family has been in contact with the Shelby County Sheriff's Office. That's right, Sherry. As a matter of fact, I'm told that deputies will actually be getting back in touch with the family within the next few days. Now, the video you're about to see, though, it's absolutely unbelievable because this woman was actually seen casing at this cemetery cemetery for about 15 minutes before she finally settled on this gravestone right here of Elizabeth Mosley. She stole mementos, but the whole time she didn't realize she was actually on camera. You can see it behind her back. You can yeah. see the wings of the butterfly. That butterfly, which is now gone, belonged to Elizabeth Lynn Mosley, placed on her grave by her daughter, Michaela, several years ago. I can't give her things anymore, like for Mother's Day or for her birthday. So I, you know, decorate her grave, you know, because I know she would want that. This video here is one thing the church and the Mosley family didn't want to see. A woman pulling up to the cemetery on Thursday. She gets out of the car and begins to study each gravestone for about 15 minutes. She then makes her way back to Elizabeth Mosley's to steal that butterfly. She more or less knows her cameras because she's hiding it behind her, but she's not exactly sure where they are. Yeah. Little did she know the cameras were right behind her, she getting a very that. clear shot of everything, <laughs> wow. including her license plate number. That's I was a little bit shocked. Um, that anyone would actually go up to a cemetery and take something off. The image of this woman is blurry, but the family is determined to find her and shame others that make a practice out of vandalizing people's resting places. Elizabeth Mosley was killed by a drunk driver on July 22nd of 2007. She is survived by four children. I didn't want to come out here to see that someone stole things off of her grave and broke things. This is people's family, you know, mom, dads, and they're just taking stuff. This is a very, very sad situation, and the family, they are asking for the public's help. If you know any information or if you recognize that car and that tag number, I want to make sure people have it. It is 5966AF1. You are urged to call the Shelby County Sheriff's Office. We have that number on our screen right now. For now, live in Shelby County, Alex Finney, CBS 42 News.